you guys, it's Melanie and welcome back to Living Luxuriously for Less, where we celebrate, decorate, and enjoy everyday life for less. Well, in today's video, we are going to be doing a Barbie dream house inspired set, complete with a custom dance floor using my all new Cricut Venture. You guys, I promise you, you are gonna be so excited about this new Cricut Venture and the amount of money and time you can save by doing this. So without any further ado, let's hop in today's video. So today's project, I'm going to create an eight by eight dance floor using Cricut Design Space. So I wanted to keep it really simple. For my logo, I just chose a font that I absolutely love along with our wedding date in Roman numerals. So this was going to be the foundation of my Barbie dream house set. Now the Cricut vinyl is a little bit over two feet wide and it comes on rolls of 75 feet. So I already configured that I could do a dance floor that was a little bit over an eight by eight, eight feet wide, eight feet long by using four pieces of vinyl. And then I use the Cricut Venture to measure out the eight feet long and I took the needle out so that I could cut each piece of vinyl the exact same length. And so that is how I did the first portion. Next up, I loaded my smart removable vinyl in the black so that I could go ahead and cut my monogram. Again, this monogram was extremely simple. I will leave a link to the actual um, program down below so that you guys can download it uh, and use it if you want to use the same exact font that I use, but it worked out perfectly. Um, it started to the process of cutting it. Very, very simple, very quick. I actually did it in real time and it only took six minutes from start to finish for this entire project, you guys. So once I did all the measuring um, of the paper and everything, it was a total of nine minutes. So once I got everything cut from the foundation of the dance floor, which was going to be the white removable vinyl, along with the actual monogram, it took me a total of, I wanna say less than 30 minutes to do this entire dance floor. Okay, so now that the monogram has been cut, I want you guys to see how easy it is to remove. This is almost in real time. I think just the process of me um, weeding out the vinyl, it took a few minutes. It was so easy. The materials were so easy to remove and these I printed um, vertically as you can see so that I could maximize the length of my actual uh, logo. So I wanted it to be two feet wide so I printed it vertically, not printed, I cut it vertically. I did not print it, I cut it vertically and so um, it was really simple to weed out the weeding process was very therapeutic for me, might I add. So once the project, once I completed the weeding um, project, I went on to transfer it over um, so that once I laid the vinyl strips, the I did four strips that were a little bit over two feet wide. I didn't cut the width of the strips, but I made sure that they were eight feet long. And so I was able to um, include those pieces or those measurements along the way. And so I will show you guys that process as well. Um, another thing that I wanted to add was this, by me going ahead and weeding it out and I went ahead and rolled it up, it was really easy for me to transport as well um, so that once I got to my actual venue, I was able to um, just you know, quickly un unroll it and lay it flat. And so once I did that, well, I wanted to go back and show you guys this step. Once I did that, I was able to go ahead and add the transfer tape so that whenever I got to the space, I could easily transfer it over. And I wanted to just make sure that I had it laying as, you know, flatly as I could because I didn't want to create any traction on the actual dance floor once we started laying down the dance floor itself. So it is important to note here that a typical vinyl dance floor that is an eight by eight can typically range anywhere from 
$850 to $2,500 depending on the complexity of the design. And so by us being able to use the Cricut um, removable vinyl, it is definitely a game changer because typically when I was doing dance floors before, they came in strips anyway. And so they're about 75 feet on a roll each. Um, they, the roll is about a little bit over two feet wide. And so we were able to lay the removable vinyl onto the floor. And, you know, later on, we're going to affix the actual logo onto the dance floor. Now, I actually measured the uh, each strip to be eight feet long because I wanted to make sure that everything was perfect. And I was able to do that by using my Cricut Venture and removing the cutting um, needle out, I was able to do so. So once we got all of the pieces laid on the dance floor, um, I wanted to just point out to make sure, you know, what the removable vinyl works on without damaging. If the floor has wax on it, it can take up the wax on the floor. But if it's just a regular wood floor, if it's cement or concrete, it works really well. So definitely do your research on the type of floor that you're going to be adhering the uh, vinyl to before you actually lay it on that floor. So that was just my disclaimer. But a typical, like, if you were to lay it on top of a dance floor, you could actually do that by laying it on a dance floor. So I wanted to point that out. So for this one, because it had wax on it, we didn't want to remove the wax. So we just... Um, attached it on each end but if it was just a regular wood floor we definitely could have attached it all the way and not have to worry about damaging uh the floor at all period and point blank so that's what we did we just affixed it on the four corners and we attached the vinyl to each other so i definitely wanted to point that out as well um, i'm going to be redoing another one this was just kind of a trial run for us and I wanted to do another one with a really big logo and we splice it, but I just wanted to try this process before we really, you know, got into creating them for our clients. This is a huge, huge, huge um, budget saver for us because we were spending, again, you know, thousands of dollars on the actual um, the vinyl dance for it. Then we were turning around and spending four or five hundred dollars for it to actually be installed. So... $150 compared to $2,000 is a tremendous savings. And because of the, Cric the Cricut Venture allows you to cut such huge projects, it allows you to batch, and it is so quick. It's kind of a no-brainer in terms of whether or not it's a good purchase for your business if this is something that you do often. So this is how, this is real time, you guys. I slowed, uh, sped the video up, but then I went back and slowed it down because I wanted you guys to see how quick it was for us to put this dance floor together. And so for the next one, um, I wanted it to do a very simple one because sometimes you may have a client that just wants a really simple monogram and wedding date on the floor. And then sometimes you may have a client that wants something a little bit more complex. If you wanted to add borders to your dance floor, you could actually cut rectangular strips out on your Cricut Venture that are eight feet long and then go around the edges with that vinyl. Um, again, because this floor was waxed before we put this down and I didn't really think about that, I didn't want to get into, um, you know, pulling up any of the wax. So this is the Roman numeral, which is a lot bigger uh, this was the, supposed to be a two piece design, but once I put it down, I felt like it was a little bit distracting, but I just wanted to show you guys how big you can actually make your dance floors and your projects. And this is a service that we can now offer in house to our clients at a discounted rate if we wanted to, but if not, we could make a really nice profit from it as well. And so to add to my set, I wanted to add in, um, a little bar cart that I also used the Cricut removable vinyl on the top to cover that bar cart. It was like a brownish color and I wanted it to be black. So I was able to go in and to do that as well. And so you guys, I am so excited about the way this project turned out. I'm going to take on something bigger now that I'm familiar and have gone through the steps of the process, but I wanted to do something that I felt like would be easy enough for you to try 
your first time and to think that we were able to create a dance floor of this size for under $150 is just insane to me because the vinyl rolls with the Cricut Venture um, are extremely affordable and you know the fact that they're removable vinyl you could take this off and you guys it's just so many possibilities with it so with that being said i'm going to give you guys a little music for your listening pleasure as i show you the final reveal just the beginning from large paper flowers to backdrops for photos marquee numbers um, batching products like t-shirts or cups for a bridal party there are so many things that you can make big for your business for your home for your school the possibilities are really endless Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know how much you enjoyed today's video down in the comments below. I want to thank Cricut again for sponsoring. And if you're interested in getting a Cricut Venture, I will leave the link down in the description box below. Until next time, it's Melanie with Living Luxuriously for Less. Cheers!